Hi, this is Carl Elmos, January 2nd, 2011, continuing on my yearly walk challenge, climbing stairs. I already did a month, uh, but I'm going to try to do the whole year of uh, every day um, walking stairs for a year outside. Uh, this is my friend Myra today. Myra, say hi, please. Oh, hi. Okay, smile. <laughs> Good. Here's the stairs that I'm walking up, plus the amazing new staircase that should be attached to the, uh, one of the videos that shows you what I'm going to be doing also. I'll be coming out here every day and walking it a little bit, and then probably doing a lot more on the amazing new staircase where I can hang, handle two rails. And uh, let me walk down here and show you uh, the other staircase, which is a beautiful place with beautiful buildings. Uh, and uh, the, 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 here's a ramp I walk up like I come down here and I, I walk up here and then I walk up another staircase which I'll show you uh, you'll be able to see it in a minute so that's what I do every day I'm only reporting to you about once a month now I used to do it every day so this will be the first video and with the other two attached, one from the beautiful view of the river from the Sheridan Hotel and also the uh, new staircase. But here's the, uh, we're getting up, coming up to the smaller staircase I want you to see. I'll hold it over the rail and show you. There it is. This is, this is a smaller staircase, about two floors, and I, I walk up that one. But as I say, I might substitute and walk a whole lot more in the new staircase where I can hold off the two handles at once. Okay, have a good day. Hi, this is Carl Elmos. This is the amazing staircase I told you about. We can hold on to two rails, and it's got about three floors. It's a pretty scene here, Chicago River in the background. The reflection, so it's hard for me to see what I'm showing you. Here's my friend Myra. Say hi, Myra. Hi. Myra, would you please take my picture coming up the stairs, and don't put your finger in front of that. Okay. Here. Yeah. And, okay. Did you count? Count what? <laughs> okay. Count what? Hi, this is Chicago Almost. It's a beautiful day today. Cold, about seven degrees. Um, I just want to show you from a, up on top the, where I walk. This is the, the actual course where I walk. I'll be taking another video down down there once I'm down there today. And um, and put them all together. Uh, YouTube allows you to put videos together now. So this is a course. I can't explain it. It's kind of too far away, but as you can see how beautiful it is. I'm taking this from a Sheridan hotel room. I'm staying here tonight, and uh, it's beautiful. They gave me. I asked for a room with a river view, and uh, there's the Hancock Building in the center. This is the Trump Tower. This is the Tribune Tower. This is the NBC building right here. NBC building. All these beautiful buildings. Did I say there was a Hancock building? No, that must be Sears Tower, I think, in the, in the way back in the distance. The Hancock building is over here. I don't know if you can see it. It's the one with the tower right there. Right there is the Hancock building. And then uh, Chicago River. Hyatt Hotel, just a marina tower in the distance. So some beautiful, beautiful buildings and some beautiful scenery here. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, go walk some stairs, take some pictures, uh, some videos. And there's a new staircase I found that's fantastic. And I can walk double stairs and hold on to two rails. Pretty excited about that one. Talk to you later. Hi, this is uh, Chicago Elmos, and what I'm doing is, um, let's see what that blue thing is in a mirror, huh? 
Oh, okay. Uh, I'm taking this in the mirror. Because I want you to see how I look. Because uh, I'm studying a special weight program in conjunction with my stair walking challenge where I walk every day uh, in, the, in the park near the river in, in Chicago. Uh, and uh, uh, so I want to have a record of how I look. So this is how I look. This is a before. I weigh 208 pounds. Uh, maybe 209. Uh, I've been walking the stairs for a week and I gained weight so I'm going to have to get serious about my diet because uh, I've been eating more. So let me just show you. Let me turn sideways here. I don't know if you can really see. But that's how I look basically. I've got a stomach. Pretty good shape uh, from walking the stairs and doing the exercises. Uh, as you can see the upper body is not flabby, it's strong. So I'm pretty good except for my stomach. And that's uh, the way it looks. But I, weigh, but I would like to get down, I like to drop at least, uh, you know, 60 pounds and be below 150. That would be great. So if I was lost 60 pounds, it would be uh, 148. I'd say that would be pretty good if I was in shape. So that's that's it. Um, let me just say in this video that my plan is to, I already, well, to, to not eat certain things, but also uh, to continue on my program of being mostly a vegetarian. I eat egg whites, I eat um, fish, I eat no, um, I haven't eaten meat or any kind of meat or chicken in over a year and that's helped me to maintain my weight because I was, I was uh, 20 pounds heavier than this. I was close to you know, 230. So that helped me maintain it but I have to be serious about losing. So to start this is going to be a challenge while I'll announce on my stair walk and my outdoor stair walking videos every day if I went off my diet. And uh, my uh, what I so my diet consists of no bread, no sweets, and I'm going to add to it no fried, f not fried food, but no breaded foods because I can eat like breaded shrimp and stuff, and and that ain't, that's not good for me. Uh, also, not more than a handful of nuts, and. Uh, Let's see if that works. That in conjunction with my vegetarian thing should, and my exercise should help me lose weight. Well, we'll see. Uh, I'll, I'll keep in touch if, uh, if I don't stick to it. And I hope in a year from now, you'll see me looking really, really skinny. Even though I know I'm, I look fantastic and handsome now already. Hi, uh, this is Chicago Elmos. I'm here by the river, Chicago River, um, at uh, Wacker. I'll show you the scenery here. And what I'm doing is I'm doing my daily walk. I'm going to see how many days in a row that I can walk 10 flights of stairs. Um, and see if I can do it for a year and I'll show you the stairs in a minute let me get up I'll show you me after I'm done walking my next flight I did five and there's the, there's the stairs from down here all the way up to there it's about three and a half flights of stairs and I want to do that ten times a day for a year you can see how beautiful this is I'll move it around and show you Here's the bench I sit on after every five. It's really cool. So this is beautiful here. I'm walking now around where I start. And in the summertime, this is even more beautiful. But you can see, you can see it here. This is the scene. And I'll explain to you what's going on uh, as I go. We're going to walk down to the First steps is the Gleacher Center, University of Chicago, graduate school. 
It's the uh, they changed the name to uh, I forgot. <laughs> Here we go. There's the East Michigan Avenue and the uh, Wrigley Building. Oh no, that's the Stone Container Building over there. This Trump Tower. Walk along. Yeah, that's the Trump Tower. You can see it. It's a beautiful building. Here's the river again. And I'll show you my starting point and I'll walk you through one round. I'll talk you through one lot round. I heard that if you climb eight flights of stairs a day, you'd be much healthier. Well, I've already climbed about 16. And it does, they don't have to be consecutive. You know, you can do them intermittently. <clears throat> but my goal is to do uh, 10 times 3 is 30 and maybe about 33 a day. I do it inside my building sometimes too. But here's the deal. It start, here's, the, here's the rail, which is terrific. You can hold on to the rail, and then it's got an, a little guard up there, and you can, it helps you hold on more. And I walk down the stairs, and then I go all the way around, and I walk up the stairs, and then come around, and walk down the stairs again. So let's do this as I hold the camera. And I usually hold on to the rail, but now I'm doing some not, and I'll show you what I do when I get at the tap of stairs sometimes is isometric exercises. So that enables me to get a complete workout. Here I'm going down the stairs. So this is the sixth time around. I've already been walking for about 20 minutes. It took me about 20 minutes. I don't do it fast. It took me about 20 minutes to walk the five flights. So I'll get a good 40 minute workout plus the rest, plus any isometric exercises that I do will be a bonus. So it's a very good workout. And uh, this is day two, December 3rd, 2010. So I'm starting my New Year's resolution early. Here's yeah, where I walk. I walk around. As you can see, I'm going up to the flight of stairs. It's really beautiful. I used to walk my cat around here when she was a kitten. But she don't like to come outside. She gets so scared. It's a battle and I don't want to upset her. So I don't bring her out. When she goes in the hall, that's what she considers outside. She runs into the hall. And that's cool with me. I would like to have a dog that can walk this with me. This is really the best kept secret in Chicago in terms of exercise. It's such a n beautiful exercise uh, a beautiful place to exercise and, and nobody knows about it. I think I'm the only one in the world that does it. Maybe after this video people will be lined up to walk up the stairs because it's it's a terrific workout. There's Marina Tower over there in the distance. Okay, let me walk up the stairs and then I'm going to show you about the isometrics. <clears throat> so I do that on little flight and I go another flight. I'm not in that good shape, good of shape. Hopefully at the end of the year if I keep it up I'll be in terrific shape. Okay, this is the second flight. And let me show you what I walked up so far. And I gotta walk up this staircase and I'll be That'll be my sixth time around, and I'll sit down and talk to you some more, and hopefully finish four more to go to ten. The goal is just to come out here every day, not necessarily to walk ten, but I like to walk ten. So that's six. So here's the bench, and I can do isometric exercises, you know, pushing up and uh, deep knee bends <clears throat> all kinds of things and end up getting good workout okay uh, 
I think in another video I'll, I'll talk about the clothes I'm wearing. But here's me.